lock the door. Oh, the grass is starting to grow pretty good now. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Farming Simulator 17 here on No Creek Farms. Episode number four, I believe. How y'all doing today? Y'all doing all right? Well, I'm doing all right. As you can see, the top right corner up there, I only got $13,000 left. Um, I have got a lot of stuff done. But, oh my God, look at the 4960. I washed the cultivator here before lunchtime. And I had to go get my bite to eat. But, folks, I just want to, you know, like I said, welcome you out back to No Creek Farms. Um, going to be kind of a boring day today. Uh, let me show you something here real quick. As you can see, it, it still probably look like another day before we can start our sunflowers. So maybe tomorrow temperature will be right. So, uh, hopefully on that. And a lot of people are asking what all this stuff is. This is, uh... Pretty much when you can sell your stuff. Um, these lines here represent, you know, like this day would be a great price to sell. Uh, looks like sunflowers, maybe crossing there somewhere. But these lines uh, will move over as the day progresses, I think. Don't hold me to it. And this is where you set your stuff. Uh, I got mine set on nine days. And uh, crop moisture and all that. Snow track, snow mode. Uh, temperature set to Fahrenheit. That's all that is. And to access this, it's all, uh, left, alt, and S. And you go le uh, left, alt, and F. This takes and brings that on and off. I like mine on so I can kind of look. As you see, tomorrow it's going to be raining. But I really need to go ahead and wash this tractor off and put it in the shed. I want to show you all one more other thing. As you can see right now, you know, we, we got one and two planted. Y'all know that. We got a uh, canola. And just show y'all and take y'all to see. Um, I got some plans, so I've been thinking. This guy up here on 17, the one that owns it, said is if I buy 16 and 17, that I can own all this right here. All this in this woods here. So that would be connecting all my fields together. And this has got a lot of grass up here that I can bail and make uh, hay, grass, and silage off of these fields here. So, yeah. And the same thing with this guy, he said if I can buy all these fields right in here that I can go ahead on this part of the creek too. So, you know, of course I got all this here. I got all this right here is mine. So, that's what I was thinking folks. You know, we get our cows on up there. But right now there's some grass right here and out in here that I can use. Especially when I'm to up this way. So that's my game plan. I'm gonna try to get 16 and 17, but you know I gotta I gotta get past this crop harvest. So, but to show you what I got done, um, I still got to cultivate this field here, but I might have to let it go. Um, we need one more fertilization on this, and it'll be done. So I'm gonna plant it and fertilize. But this here, I got a, a layer of fertilization, and all this here has been cultivated, and it's ready. So we'll spray it one more time, and it'll look like this. So I might not get as much. So yeah. But anyway, it's pretty much it, folks. Uh, let me wash this tractor off, and I'll be right back, okay? All right, now don't that look much better? Ah, oh, so clean, so so clean. All right, y'all probably wondering why I got water turner over here. 
Well, you can get water from this right here. This is the water trigger. But it will take the money directly out. I mean, well, yeah. It'll take the money directly out of your account up there. So, uh, you can bring your trailers right here and fill them up. So, I did fill that up. And I'm sorry, I don't know off screen, but I just want to do a little testing. But, okay, you go right down here. Right here is the water trigger. I mean, the water trial. But, folks, you got to come on the inside. The water trigger is about right in here somewhere. You got to back up to it on this side. If you back up to the other side, it will not do it. You have to be on the inside of the fence. So, uh, I ain't done no food or nothing yet. Let's go up here and look and see what it looks like in our, uh, our thing up here that we got. You can see now the cows has 1,060 liters of water. So I'm on. It, it, it'll take a couple more episodes, but we will be getting into cows soon. Hopefully after the harvest. But I thought about buying a bale of each. Uh, like a bale of straw. A bale of grass. And... So, it, I don't know about power food. I don't know if we can buy it or not. Let's go out here and go over real quick. Um, I may be fast forward time when I do this. Um, I gotta think what it's under, folks. I, I, it's been so long. Ah, right, here we go. We got straw bales, square and round. Grass bales, or, or some hay bales, I'm sorry. Square and round, whichever one we choose. Sellage bales. Okay, so no total ration bales. So what we have to do. Now, on power food. Hey, Sullage, let me, let me show you here. Go back in this screen here. Sullage and hay and power food is all together. Now, you can do Sullage and hay, and I'll bring that up. But if you mix power food, okay, take one bale of straw, one bale of hay, or, or two bales of hay and one bale of Sullage, or either or. It's only one bale of straw, but the other two, you can add like, two hay or two silage with one or the other and you can get power food and usually it fills the this up too so we need to base it off that so we need one straw two straw bells actually maybe more uh, two straw bells two silage bells no it'll be four silage bells probably and two grass bales, uh, you know, to go in here. Anyway, we'll we'll get to that. We'll get to that. Uh, on this episode here, I just mainly want to, like I, I think I already showed y'all. Um, I got the equipment sitting here. I got the, the plow disser and the, the wagon. Um. I need to lease a auger wagon before my money runs out or I won't be able to buy it. Because uh, we, we got to keep this here. We'll load, put that up there to load in. And because um, we're going to sell this planter, we're going to run this planter out of seeds. Let me fast forward time while I'm doing this. Cause, oh, wrong one. Do about maybe 30. That way y'all can see. Or 60. That way y'all can see the night. But I'm going to use this combine this episode. I mean uh, this season. Maybe uh, next year we can upgrade it. But I'm going to sell this planter. Take this tractor. The 78 and trade it in on a four wheel drive. And um. Like I said, I need a auger wagon before my money runs out. Now, I hate to get one right now. 
So I'm probably going to have to use the wagon over here uh, to begin with. I don't know how much. Uh, so we got some fertilized left. Uh, we got this tractor and the barn. I don't know why the lights stay on, but I didn't watch this yet. This is lease, so we got to get rid of this as soon as we get done planting. When I get everything planted, folks, I'm going to fast forward time and, and go from there. So, yeah. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and I don't have nowhere to park this tractor. I'm, well, this cultivator. I'm sorry, this cultivator. I don't have nowhere to park. So let's raise it up. Go ahead and fold it. This cultivator is awesome. Actually, you know what? I need to get some fuel. Not too much fuel. Tell you what, that should be enough fuel. Well, let's uh, head on over. I need to make a courseway route, but I can't do it right now. Because I'm fixing to fast forward to the next day. Oh lordy, the things we do. The thing. I know it's early. Oop, no, shut this off. Early spring, and I still don't know why this Christmas tree is out here. It's a Easter egg, and it's supposed to be a snowman too. So we gotta keep our eyes open for that. But I'm hoping the canola folks will uh, show you which one I want to get real quick. Uh, while we're waiting on the time, go to uh, auger wagons. Um, thought about getting this thing here too. I would need both of them, so that's forty-two thousand dollars there. Uh, I'm thinking about leasing this in here. It's the smallest one, I believe, that I got. Yeah, besides the John Deere. There. Um. So yeah, the canola will not go into the grain tanks, so we may have to get this bagger system. Because, uh, you see, it's a lot to this, folks. Sunflowers, uh, we can plant them probably tomorrow, where it looks. And the harvest on them ain't too, too far along. Um... But you can look right here, sunflowers, the best time to sell them it is going to be, oh, there we go, whoa. Now let's, let's look at something. We can, we can harvest them in the fall. Uh... First day of fall, where it looks, yeah. So, uh, all right, you take that sunflowers first day of fall, and you go over here, okay. First day of fall would be this line right here. Follow it up, it's about the best price. We get a little bit more for it in the spring, early spring. No, middle spring. But uh, I think we're just going to sell them direct as we get them out of the field. That's what I'm thinking about. That's what I'm thinking about, folks. Let's see, what's our time? We need to run our time up just a little bit more. You can't go too fast. If you go too fast, it will uh, render or both. To the correct time, but we don't. We need to cultivate that field over, but we can do that as we're planting. So basically, I just want to take this video because um, we're already about 15 minutes in. I want to get to where we're planting. I slowed it down. I was going the wrong way. Alright, 
Let's go about 120. Oh, our lights popped on. You see the Christmas tree there. There's our tree. There's our lights to our house. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I think we can skip night now. So I'm going to take my time down. There we go. And hit F1 here. And left Alt and N. We can skip night. So left Alt and N. Uh, skip night. Do you want to skip night until morning? 6 a.m. or dawn at 6.46. So let's go ahead and skip to dawn. Resting for another day at the farm. Mmm. Snores. Oh, oh, there we go. Yeah, it'll take a little bit. I kind of like this in a way, in a way I don't. Cause on some maps, it's so dark, like uh, Upper Mississippi River Valley, if I was using uh, Seasons on it, it would be grateful because the nights are so dark, you can just skip them. Um, but yeah, just remember it does, you know, if you got a lot of work to do, you might want to wait about skipping and do some of that work. Yeah, like I said, it, it does take a little bit. But that's what I was doing. I was cultivating like maybe almost to 10, 11 o'clock at night. And then I'd, you know, fast forward then. But I, I wish that the creator of this map would let you cut the trees down. That's the only thing I have against this map. I love this map more than. The rest of my, as of right now, you know, but the only thing I got against it is the the tree cutting. You can't cut the trees, or at least I couldn't. I don't know. It might be conflict with one of the mods or not. So, if any of y'all out there played this before, uh, and you can cut trees on it, let me know. That way, I'll know if it's a mod or something wrong with the map on my end. Come on. I may have to skip some of this out. There we go. Uh, bring that down. We 7,500 loan interest. Ooh. Vehicle leasing costs is 1,212. Vehicle running costs 1,245. Property maintenance is 13. Folks, that loan interest is what's killing us. 7,500. Ooh, I got to get that. But we got rain today. We're mid spring. And look at this grass, folks. This grass is up there. Can we harvest yet? I mean, not harvest, but mow. We can mow some grass. That would be excellent. Uh, let's get over here. And by the way, it's still showing. Our uh, growth is off. All right, there's all the grass. You just highlight it and then go over to growth. Look at there, folks. It's showing grass is ready to harvest. All we need is at the early stage of harvest. So we need more. But we only got $3,000. Um, so there's our soil. There's our harvest. So grass is ready to harvest. Do I have a mower? Oh, I need to go go back one more. Take that off. It just shows the map a little bit better. Um, or as I know, I don't have a mower. I do not have a mower. I just got the combine, the planter, tractor. Oh, folks, I do not have a mower. Oh, let's see where we're at. Can we plant corn? Can we plant corn now? Uh, I mean, sunflowers. That's on the edge of it. I just wonder if we can. 
Um, Forty-five degrees. Some fires gotta be forty-five degrees to plant. Okay, and it's right there at it. I hate to plant sunflowers and it don't work, but I think we can. All right, forty-five degrees. Okay, and I don't know, it's still showing 39 degrees and 36 degrees. Is that going to change? Man, I hate to speed up one more day. But I hate to take a chance. Let's look at this real, real quick. I think we need to go one more day. Yeah, let's go one more day. Can we skip nine again? Uh, no, we're going to have fast forward time. It's going to rain anyway. Let's see what the rain is going to do. Uh, while we're doing this. I need to take this tractor down and around and make a course play to go to at least the blue dot at 16 and then we could drive to rest or make another one so yeah let me uh, slow time down just a little about right there all right, we're going to go ahead and make a course play, folks. Where do I want to start this? Um, I need this map up. I need to go down. So I think I want to basically start this course play about right here. And this be kind of the best tractor to do it with. All right. Uh, don't want no workload, so right there. And we're just going to start course recording. Right, folks, there we go. I'm going to try to stay like over here. Eh, ain't going to work too much. They stay about right there. And it only does 21 mile an hour, so that's about good. You, know, you don't want to go too fast. You just keep in mind that you might want to use this course with other vehicles. So you want to make sure, like you're pulling a trailer or something, that you slow down. And that way it won't tail spin or jackknife or anything like that. So. But this won't take very long. We'll do this here and uh, speed time up to the next episode. Or, <laughs> yeah, to the next episode. We want to speed time up to the next day, and that should be uh, late spring, maybe. Because see, every every nine days it changes so one through three you would have early spring four five and six would be mid spring and then seven eight nine would be late spring so every nine days it changes uh, the seasons so basically you got nine days of spring, nine days of summer, nine days of fall. Okay, I'm going to slow down right here because we got to take this right here. And 
There we go. We're going to get back on the road. And it's not too much further. Yeah, every time I hit LB, right B, and B, it takes the uh, stuff off up there. And it's also part of my cruise. And I'm driving on the wrong side of the road. But look, I think it's grass right there that we can mow. If I'm not mistaken. Um, just wish I had a mower. But of course, if I get a mower, you know, I need a baler. And I know I don't have that kind of money, so. Alright, we'll come up to another curve here. And then we'll be heading back north. Alright. And this is going to get us on up there. Uh, yeah, we got one, two, three fields to pass, and then uh, we'll be at 16. I just hope there ain't no gates. We'll have to stop at the first gate, so I hope the first gate is at 16. Um, as far as I know, folks, there is no missions. And I done tried a couple of them, and it says no mission available. I like to cover two butts in this game, too. There's another field there. And then a field right there where the missions are at. And uh, like I said, I'm going to show y'all while I'm doing this, try to do two things at once. Um, if I can buy a 16 and 17, I can have all that land there in between. So I think that's where we're going to do our, our bailing there and, uh, of course, out in our pastures at the shop. Right, I'm going to slow down again. And don't look like we have a gate here. We don't. Okay. Uh oh, here comes the rain. Oh man. Well, at least I got the cultivator up here. Um. I think I'm going to stop right here because this is going to be pretty much where we need to go. I guess no gate to the next spot up there. So. All right, I'm going to stop. Uh, I'm going to save. And this is going to be... Farm. Why? Ah. Farm. To field 16. Error. There we go. And um, I'm just going to close this out. Close. I wonder if it'll let us do field work while it's raining. We got to go up here to our other field. We don't have 16 yet. I wonder what that other symbol means the tree and the raindrops oh ooh, ooh. crap I almost hit that post I almost hit that post yeah now I want to unfold I'm just going to see if we can uh, do this it, it shouldn't let us but I think it's going to and it's going to let us Right, I'm not <laughs> okay the rain stop I'm gonna let the uh, sun come out before I go uh, do any of this but anyway um, let's see 
32% moisture, 33%. Okay. So we need to check out our canola field. Let's run out there real quick and check it out. Ah. All right, I guess this is the growth. 20% moisture, 100%, whatever that is, 32% moisture. Cool. Okay. Um, oh, wrong one. Let's go to this one real quick. Yeah, I believe we could plant. But uh, it's late, so it's supposed to be sunshine tomorrow, which is the fifth day. So we'll have two days to plant, where it be. Or is it more? Yeah, we can go to the nine days of planting, so that should be six days. Oh, we got one, two, three, four, three, four, five. So today would have been a sixth day. So we could have planned it today. But anyway. Uh, let's see. Can we skip night? Yeah, we can skip night, folks. So, uh, okay. I'm going to skip night and show y'all what I will be down to. So I'm going to slow the time down. Uh, left all and in. Um, I'm gonna skip it to six o'clock this time. And I know that's gonna take a little bit, but it'll give me time. Whoa! That was quick. That it was quick, folks. I'm minus 6,870. I, I think that's going to be bad for me. I really do. Um, I do want to do one thing, folks. I know. Uh, I, I doubt if they'll let me borrow. Borrow. Okay, it will let me borrow on this. Okay, so that's good. I can buy some equipment. I need to buy a mower. Now you get that auger wagon. I need to get a mower and a baler. And a spike for the front loader. And a trailer to load bales on. But anything. I need to buy some seeds. I need to get the planting done, folks. Let's look here at this. Oh, yeah. See, we could have planted yesterday. I, I should have. But this is the second day of, uh, what is it, mid-spring? Yeah, mid-spring. So, yeah. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to go get the tractors uh, ready for next episode. Uh, let's go over here and see which tree is gone. Yay, the Christmas tree is gone. Any other? If I happen to see any other uh, Easter eggs, I'll be sure and let y'all know. But I do need a trailer. I got the gooseneck. I got the flatbed. I forgot about them. I can load the uh, seeds up on them. But, uh, yeah. We're going to get the 82. Or the 7800 two-wheel drive going first. And we need to run the seeds out of it and then sell this planter. And trade this tractor in on that 7800. We're probably just going to trade it in. 
and get the 7800 later when we got more money because I know we don't have enough to par. But um, yeah, folks, so I guess till next time. Now, ah, let me shut this off. I'm going to go right over here. I'm going to shift eight to clear all this off. And this is probably going to be the thumbnail. But, uh, yeah, folks. Thank you for watching. Thank you for all your support. And most of all, just thank you for the love, folks. Y'all been awesome. But uh, I'm well over my minutes. I'm going to go 35, 36 something minutes. But anyway, I enjoy doing this. And I hope y'all enjoy watching. And until next time, folks, y'all have a great day. A blessed day here with Mr. Blue. We'll see y'all later. Bye, y'all.